right, Dane, we got a special one here today. Um, got an email, uh, gosh, way back in, I want to say April, May, uh, back when I had the hip, so I got plenty of email and had time to read it, that there was a special bottle of Whistle Pig coming out, and they were going to make this 100% rye, the six-year-old uh, piggyback with David Ortiz's bats. And... Uh, you yep. can't say no to that. Can't say no to that, and I didn't. So, twice. Twice. So it showed up. One of them showed up on my doorstep, which it made knowing this guy for what 15, 20 years now actually worth it. At least fifty years. Yeah. I think. 2006. Do the one. Do the math. <laughs> carry the one. Yeah. Anyway. Anyway, we we got two bottles, and since David got or, uh, inducted into the Hall of Fame last week. We thought it was time to bust into one of them. So we're gonna bust into mine. And again, the thing that's cool about this is they flavored this 100% uh, rye whiskey with uh, his maple wood bats. So while I'm uh, opening this up, Dame, go ahead and give us some wiki knowledge on it. I mean, I really don't have a lot on this one. We could just talk about David Ortiz, man. I mean, <laughs> where, where do you even start with this guy? Dude is clutch. Uh, there is no 2004 without, uh, well, without Dave Robert, without Millar. Well, without the whole team. Without the whole team. But Ortiz but, is clutch hitting. I mean, those, the extra innings, I mean, what well, is it? Yeah, well, it's clutch I mean, but, that, but that, the hit in what, the 14th, 15th Yeah, inning? the blooper. And the blooper, it, yeah, I mean. And the home run. Uh, it, I mean, the guy. The guy. The yeah. guy, he's the man. He's the man, and then continue to just show up clutch for years after that up until what 2014 15 yeah something time? like that yeah and then he was on the 2014 team that uh won the world series again 2014 team whatever the year it was whatever it was 2004 2007 2013 13, 13. 2018 oh. but he wasn't on the 18 team no of course of course yeah yeah, yeah. wasn't on the 18 but. team so uh anyway Let's uh, get after this again, 100% yeah. rye, and here's to Poppy. Congrats, man. All right, we getting, ooh, it smells good. Sweet and spicy. So I was tracking this thing from the day I ordered it, and then they sent me a thing that was gonna be back ordered. I was like, God damn it. And, um, and then I had it, uh, and so I was shipping one to him too, and he didn't know it was coming. So, um, so when I, they, they sent me a thing saying it's, co it's coming today, and I'm like, um, hey, is anybody at your house today, by the way? Because in Florida, you have to have somebody sign for it. And, I honestly uh, thought that I was going to open the door, there's going to be like a flaming bag of poop on it or something. Like, I was like, what does he even care that I'm home for? Man. This is sweet. It smells yeah, really good. So anyway, he was like, he was totally shocked that it, that it came in. So... It, it smells. I mean, I'm in a baseball frame of mind, and it just, uh, it, it just, it smells. I, I, you're getting the, you know, the vanillas, the caramels that are the typical, usual. but you're getting some spice, some oak. I mean, it's just, it seems like a, a pretty, oak. pretty uh, well balanced. Kind of floral. Yeah, kind of floral. You, you're getting that. You know, yeah, I'm getting floral because it's a rye. It's 100 percent rye, yeah. so you're gonna get some kind of herby. You know, maybe mm. some eucalyptus or something like that. Mm. There's something there, spearmint, something. Right. Well, let's give it a let's give it a drink. Let's see what Cheers happens. again to Poppy. Oh, that's good. Oh man, that's it's super leggy. It's a nice leggy. mix. That's super leggy. Let's see if I can get this in the. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> We're a small operation here. Ken had to look at the camera <laughs> himself to make sure well, he was I've, doing I've it Well, I've done right. that multiple times in that camera and, and totally missed. Yeah, so. I mean, my sister's over there. I mean, this time she's not on her phone, but she's not willing to help, she's just obviously. She's petting the dog. She's petting just, the dog, you know. Did you get, did you get it's like... It's freaking good. This is good, man. You get like it, some serious spearmint? I don't or know about mint. I get, I get you mint. Get, you get some type of note like that. I mean, I'm getting more of the spice. You get like, you know, rye spice, baking spice, cinnamon. But also, I'm getting some sweetness, the vanilla. Um, it's just a really nice mix. It's easy spice. It's viscous, like you're saying, the mouthfeel. Like it's just, it's just good. Just good. Just damn good. It's just like poppy. poppy. Just, just damn, damn good. good. Just, just, just damn yeah, good. So good. What's your favorite poppy moment? Um, 
Dude, mm. it has to be. Well, I can tell you my worst. Po- I'm gonna give you my worst Poppy moment. Didn't ask for it, but okay. So Poppy decides to steal second base. <laughs> That's and, a bad idea. And, and, and yeah, and what was it? Game? I think it was, it was uh, the same game where Dave Roberts. So in game, uh, game four. Four. Yeah. Poppy in the second or third inning decides to steal second base. Um, he was out by a long way. <laughs> Sixty <ways>. feet. <laughs> a long ways. Uh, and then uh, the, the you know the the home run I think in Dude. the home run in game five is, is unbelievable unbelievable where he just he just walked up and you knew it was going to be a poppy moment yeah and he just had it he just had it just had that guy just had it yeah just, just had, had it. it yeah and there were times when you just knew that. The, when he came up and he'd spit in his hands and mm. slap his hand, and there were times where you're like, he's got this guy, and it's mm. gonna be a, it's gonna be a good thing, and and usually it worked out. I mean, that's why he's a Hall of Famer. So you mentioned spit in his hands. I mean, they put the bat in here, which he would spit in the hands and put on the bat. I'm I'm hoping that's not what's going on here. Well, yeah, I, I spit all over it. <laughs> Just for the hell of it, I thought I'd spit all it for Poppy. For Poppy. All right, I think we're good. <laughs> I, think we, I think this is the end of the show. No, we're not. I think we're this is good. the end of the Beachside Bros. <laughs> so, so what I thought I'd do is, um, since we had Poppies, and I, I know this is this is the standard offering whistle pig um, that you can get in every store. It's, it's pretty res- readily available. Uh, Got that, bro? Yeah, it, it's, it is available. Uh, this is the whistle pig piggyback standard again 100 percent rye but i thought uh, we would uh give this one a shot just to see how it compares to what uh they're offering with poppy sure and since natalie's petting the dog you know (laughs) oh she's not paying she's just sitting there not helping (laughs) i'm gonna being her natalie self (laughs) i'm gonna say my favorite poppy moment it was on the baseball field but not during a game i think after the the marathon bombings, when Poppy oh, came on the field, classic, classic. I mean, it was I just short, you know, thanking the police, thanking the, you know everybody for what they do, and then just Poppy, you know, this is our bleeping city. Yeah. I mean, it just gal, it it summed up what Bostonians were feeling, galvanized everybody, and it was just yeah. just badass. And, and so, you got family badass. in Boston, so yes, that's uh, the great yeah. thing. I am a I am a Boston fan by. Uh, my cousin Susan's also mm-hmm. here, mm-hmm. and her father was signed by the Red Sox a, a long time ago. That is super cool. <laughs> and he was also, cool. uh, for some reason, a horrible Yankee fan. Um, yeah. But uh, oh. he was signed. But my dad, his brother, always loved the Red Sox. So we always rooted for the Red Sox. Went to Red Sox games. And Your dad had the best Red Sox stuff when we were up there. Yeah, yeah. Best memorabilia. Yeah, Grandpa's got. He, we ha- actually have a uh, 1970, I want to say seven, uh, yearbook signed by all of the mm-hmm. Red Sox. Yaz, Fisk, Fred, Fred Lynn, who was the coolest guy ever. Yeah. Uh, and uh, yeah, we we have tons of Red Sox crap. So we're Red Sox fans by proxy, but love the Red Sox. I don't like you, but I like that you like the Red Sox. Well, we're kind of stuck with each other at this point. All, <laughs> All right, right, so, so this, this is the other one. Okay. This is a new one. This All is right. just regular old six-year-old piggyback. Same thing, just without the bat and the spit. It, it doesn't even smell anything close. No, it's not as sweet. Not, not near as sweet. That is crazy. This is sweet, mellow. This is more ethanol, for sure. Yeah. Colors are similar. This one's well, this one's more. It's richer. Uh, definitely richer. richer. Definitely sweeter. Mm-hmm. I mean, it's good. It just doesn't have the complexity. It doesn't have the viscosity of the mouth feels. Yeah, a lot of pepper. Yeah. A lot of the, that rye spice that you normally would associate. But mm-hmm. yeah, it's not nearly. I, and I think that I, uh, approachability. This is. I mean, that's still good. Yeah, it's it's yeah. still good. It just doesn't have a lot of the sweeter if notes. If you hadn't had this one first, yeah. you would say this one's really. It's, uh, it's really just lighter. It's just thinner, I'd say. Yeah. Thinner on the flavor. Yeah, this profile. is. Yeah. That's because it's got Red Sox uh, Big Poppy Bats in Yeah, it. man. Big Poppy Spit. <laughs> Big Poppy Spit. 
That's on the top. Yeah, <laughs> perfect. Uh, so I think this is pretty straightforward, Ken. Thumbs up, thumbs down. Uh, yeah, this one's going in the back of the uh, mud sink. Uh, <laughs> the vault, which yeah. is the, held together with rubber bands. Yeah, because that would be uh, that would be Gonski. So I'm gonna have well, to. Well, we got a little bit of time tonight. We, can, we got a little we can bit put of time. Some air. I'm gonna put an air in that one. Oh, uh, you can have the ten year old store pick from Virginia. <laughs> so, so yeah, this one is man, that is really good. It's I wish I, I I thought about buying four, mm. and I should have. Because uh, that's that is really really good. It is good. Um, yeah, and, and again, the 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 six year old piggyback, we'll we'll do something with that with the, some other rise, but uh, maybe in a blind with sure. the willet and everything. Because you know, and but man, it's good. It's good. All right, it's guys. Good. Well, thanks for watching. As always, like, subscribe, ring the bell, check us out <laughs> on Insta at Beachside Bros Jacks. And we'll uh, see you guys next time. Go Thanks for watching. In a horrible year. Congrats, Poppy. <laughs> yeah, congrats to Poppy. Cheers. <laughs>